Hello everybody, Mr. Storm here. Welcome back to Stellaris. In the last episode, we're continuing with our project to try to uh, get back to a peacetime state. Get rid of these wars, as many of them as we can. Um, we are working on this area. Trying to bomb this planet. Problem is, these guys have just tons of defense armies. And so trying to successfully invade these planets is going to be difficult. Not impossible, but difficult. One of the uh, they, you know empires here that we're at war with are these guys. I'm pretty sure it's these guys. No, it's not those guys. It's these guys. No, it's this. These guys. Here. Are we also at war? No. Problem is, uh, borders are closed. So, that's a bit of an issue. Uh, we are sending a fleet into this area here. I believe, if I recall correctly... Scroll down. All right. Task Force 2 is bombing. Task Force 1 is on its way out there. Yes. Yep. I want to see what this is, if that's an actual issue or not. Um... And the home fleet is still MIA um, and for another couple of months. So, I'll wait for them to come back, and then we will send them somewhere. So, we will see. Now, over here, invading these planets is going to be very difficult, but we're going to have to do it. Right? Because I cannot just sit here and wait for these planets to grow, slowly grind down because we're just going to get more and more and more of these rebellions and we need to end these and we need to end them fast and so I'm thinking what I'm going to have to do is throw bodies at the problem so we've captured a few of these planets over here the planet of bat so let's recruit hologram army they are incredibly expensive but look at the damage they do we can build a couple of them okay um two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's nine. We do clone armies because they're generally faster. to get up to one two three there we go 29 it's another 30 army set coming off of that planet uh, let's see over here we only support two. Oh no we can get these hologram armies Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
Let's get those trained up. I don't know how long that is going to take. 150 days per army. So... Let's see what we can do here. Now, as long as we're bombing them, they can't recover. 3756 is the total combat power of those ground forces. We have... 2.7 plus 2.7 that's 5.4 okay if we land all of those armies so we'll take a beating we will take an absolute beating but we can replace the armies Oh, in fact, we probably have another planet over here. A couple of them, actually. Oh, no, we can't recruit from that one. No, wait a minute, that's not ours. Never mind. I thought it was for a second, because it was a very similar color, but it's not. But we have this planet over here. Do we have any other good... These hologram armies. I think this is from that one, like, multi-stage... Um... Archaeology series that we did. 25 assault armies... Train those up. Like those should be absolutely devastating if we use them. So, research complete. Hold on. We got two research. Code breaking plus two. Uh, mercy point defense. Phase plasma cannons. The Quadria reactor. Uh, physics research. Research station output. That might be good. Let's go with that. Demagogue training. Yeah, we're working on that. What else do we have? Army damage plus 10%. Well, that's very expensive. Create penal colony. I mean, we might just research that to get it out of the way. Yeah, let's just get that out of the way.
All right, someone is integrating a subject. We are not currently integrating a subject. This is still growing. This is very annoying. It might slow down eventually. We're just going to, because we had similar one, uh, similar events, which kind of kept going and going, and then eventually they reached a point where they, they rolled backwards. So we'll just hope that that resolves itself at some point. All right. We will probably lose all of these armies. But so be it. Everybody land. We're going to recruit some clones here. here. We have an actual planet over here that's colonized, so we will use these robotic assault armies. No, we're going to use clones. Robotics are the problem. I think. Planetary yeah. Invasion begun. There's no armies there. If I can just get my troops there, I can end that war. It's just, it's just these guys here that are. Can we establish an embassy with them? We have two envoys there that are improving relations. I've sent them some stuff just as a gift. Like, come on, I just need you to open your borders for like a year. Just, just a year, let me get through there, end this war and then get out. things going over here. Yeah, if at some point this number goes below that number, we'll just have to retreat.
They refuse the embassy. That's unfortunate. Colonization in progress. Oh, we're colonizing a planet? Excellent. Patrol Fleet Gamma. We were moving the Heavy Leto Fleet. Uh, yes, because of these guys here. Michal Deninatis, Sultanus Nadir. We're going to want to deal with them. Research complete. Heavy concussion missile. All right. Factory ship hull points. Explosive weapon speed. Orbital bombardment damage. Explosive weapon speed. Complete construction of their benign terraforming in the Trianis or the Iriani system. All right, well, we'll just keep an eye on that. Hopefully, that goes our way, but I expect us to take heavy losses. Now we have a bunch of stuff going on in the Soul system. Oh, there's our home fleet. You're all the way back here. Um, is there really anywhere else that you guys can go? Okay, let's let's take a look at all of our enemies. Where are you? Is there anything that we can do? There's that one that we just need some open borders. Maybe we can take care of that. The Superhuman Council is over there. Again, massive garrison. That's significantly smaller. If we can deal with this and come out of here with at least something decent, and we can get some of these new armies up and running, then we can we can deal with that. Ultra Gargaxton Star Union. Where are you guys? You are way out there, and Task Force 1 is actually right over there, but we don't really need... We just need to land armies there. Um... Not you, not you, not you. The entire rest of the military is down here.
Cannot land armies on an uninhabited planet. Oh, this is one of those. Well, that means I'm going to have to do this the uh, unfortunate way. Just a moment. Alright, because that's bugged, I just had to remove it. So it is now gone. And they are now gone. And that war is now gone. All right. Super Hondarian block. Way over there. That is where one of my task forces is heading. Right, that's where Task Force 2... Where are, where are you going? Oh. You found yourself another route. Very good. Um, then head in there. Yeah, okay. We already have a fleet heading in that direction. All right. Barongo Claris Union... is over here. We have no eyes on it whatsoever. All right then, home fleet, head over there. Let's figure out what's going on. Romantis. Romantis Variatus Nation has become more spiritualist. Construction complete. Mining station has been completed. All right, good. Let's spend one of those. All right, yeah, confirm that. All right, this guy. There's a habitat. There. They're in the Rothelian League. Okay. We'll get up there. Research complete. Construction complete. All right, create penal colony is done. Monthly society research. See, expensive, 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 expensive. These two are the same. So we want additional monthly society research or more food from unlock Starbase mon uh, module planetary soil fertilizer. Monthly society research.
Uh, we're still all right here. How are we doing as far as our new armies? Well, looks like we haven't got much of anything there yet. We're starting to get our clone armies up and running. The new holographic stuff, not so much. Almost done. Eight days. Okay. All right. Yeah, we're, we're gonna we're gonna get through that. I'd almost want to say, you know, as soon as we get those hologram armies, let's just immediately send them in because they're gonna be so powerful. But no, we'll let the armies actually form. We'll see what the results of this invasion are, and then we'll make decisions at at that point. Incoming transmission. All right, you guys want a migration treaty? We will say yes to your migration treaty. And they still did not want to do an embassy. Come on, guys. Consolidated human clans. Busy improving relations. We don't really need that anymore, so let's send you to begin establishing an, a spy network. They don't want to start a war to try to end one. I think that would be somewhat silly. If they just had like a wormhole or uh you no know, or something there. A gateway to get me through. That'd be nice, but Unfortunately, not. The Defensive Readiness Group, which has until now been a small descent element with the United Grand Republic of Earth, has concluded an alliance with the Union of Traditional Values. They have been actively agitating for major change. They have found sufficient common ground to join their forces together, which they hope will allow them to form an unsolvable force with which to see their vision of a traditionalist isolationist state realized. Worrying.
All right, well, let's take a look. Human Ascendancy block only has eight pops in it. The Union of Traditional Values. That one is a bit more troublesome. We'll try and suppress that faction. Yeah, let's suppress them both. It wouldn't take too long to get those armies landed. The Union of Traditional Values has gained influence on Viral Khaned to the degree it can be considered their stronghold. We must take action urgently or the planet may be lost to us. And I'm not sure what action that we would need to take. Sure. We declare martial law. We probably need to automate automate this one. Yeah, I'm not even sure what we could actually do. But we apparently hold territory up there. That's interesting.
Hmm. You know what? I am going to go ahead. I'm, I'm, I'm considering this. Let's send these armies in. We have this one. Have a bunch more here. Send those in. They're going to take a little bit longer to get there. I do have this pile right here. I could send them in. Because it doesn't look like we're going to get through these guys anytime soon. I'll just send you some energy credits. Let's see what happens there. We have a archaeological site. No, it's been discovered. We discovered a new one. Okay. Well, we're not going to be doing anything up there, so not that worried about it. All right. Bring them in. Fortunately, it looks like that this is just not going to be a thing. This could be quick. So. We'll have to figure that out. I mean, if it comes right down to it. If it comes right down to it and they're the last one on the board. I'll go ahead and declare war on them. I think we are winning here. I think we are winning. Stronghold at Vril Conned won back. We managed to exert our influence. All right, good to know. Excellent. Oh, a peace treaty was formed. Star Nation, formerly known as the Rongo Claris Union, has been destroyed. Was that one of these? Yes, it was. It was one of those. Beautiful. Was it one? Was it the one that that we were trying to get to? No. That's what we're trying to get to. This is the human human mutatis confederacy. Was it the one that we were sending the home fleet to? Where? 
It looks like it probably was. Okay. So home fleet can now do something else. And I have an idea of what they're going to do. Ooh. New tradition available. Uh, in fact, we can go ahead and just select a new one. Perseverance. Armor hit points. Defense platforms. Sublight speed. War exhaustion gain. Influence gain from rivals increased. Justice. Crime minus 25%. Or minus 25%. Unity output has increased. Well, we have a whole lot of stored influence. Happiness, monthly unity, edict cost. Piracy growth is reduced. Empire size from planets is reduced. Stability is increased. I kind of like this injustice one. Let's go ahead and adopt that one. Ah, those are reinforcement ships. Orbital Bastion complete. Our orbital barracks in the solar system are now upgraded to a bastion. Uh, with this facility complete, we are able to more effectively train large numbers of personnel. Holographic simulators and zero-g arenas make for a wonderful place to teach our pilots and soldiers alike. Excellent. Effects. Naval capacity plus 30, fleet command limit plus 2. Alright. Military administration branch. We need a thousand unity, which we're, we'll get next month. So we're going to definitely do that. It'll increase... My naval capacity to plus 60. Fleet command limit plus 4. I would have thought that um, naval capacity would have been increased significantly more than that, but I mean, I'll take what I can get. Just waiting for the end of the month. Uh, actually, while we're waiting, uh, let's see. Is that done? That is at 66% complete. No. 161 days left on the next stage of the atmospheric purifier. All right. Uh, what about the mega shipyard? Twenty days remaining. Uh, you are upgrading to a star fortress. Two hundred seventy-two days left. Very good. Uh, well, the Union of Traditional Values is once again has a stronghold on Viral Khaned. Right. 
Research complete. All right, explosive rep weapon speed. Turbo laser fire rate. That's very expensive. Hybrid Japan Avengers class mass drivers. Modular maintenance bay. Quantum missiles. Let's get the improved Vengeance class mass drivers. How goes the invasion? Still going, but I think we're going to win. There's our transports with the holographic armies. Here's our transports with our other armies. We'll keep them coming in just in case, and we're going to need them for the next stages of this. We're just going to... Try and put these guys down completely. Yeah, home fleet. Uh, what I wanted to do is send you over. I was going to send you over here. Yeah, let's send you over here. Those two planets are being bombed. Get you coming over here. I mean, they are ready to go. Like, there are no armies. Just land something, anything. Are there no armies here? No, there's some armies there. All right. We'll send armies in that direction to see if we can't put that one down. The mega shipyard framework is done. We need 10,000 alloys. What effect are we getting off of it right now? Ship build speed. We have five shipyards. Are you capable of building? Like, uh, our Titans or anything. It doesn't look like it. Only battleships. Okay.
Substance abuse. Our ambassador Gore has for some time been concerned at the performance of Xia Zhang, one of our envoys of the galactic community. Now evidence has come to light that she appears to have fallen prey to an alien substance from the Taruvite or Taverite Enlightened Kingdom and has proven extremely addictive to humans. Though the trade in this substance is highly illegal. Okay. Unassigned. No. Fire. The Superhuman League of Worlds has been destroyed by its enemies. Well, that, get Construction complete. that got rid of one of our wars. Beautiful. Let me build and upgrade two mega structures at a time. Is that the Bastion and... The Atmospheric Purifier. Okay, well, we'll have to wait till the Atmospheric Purifier is done. Not a problem. Additional forces are going to be landing here. Our two brand spanking new holographic armies. I don't think they're going to go directly. Um, into combat. Unfortunately, if I just sit, uh, the only way I'll know if they're actually in combat is if I just kind of sit here and watch. Why are you just sitting there? I thought I gave you orders. Oh, because you guys closed your borders again. Oh my goodness. All right, let's send someone to improve relations there again. Well, what that means is that the armies that I have there right now are the armies that are going to have to get this done. So... We'll see how it goes. Okay. 
Looks like we need upgrades. All right. All of these fleets merge. There we go. Uh, that's a whole bunch more battleships. Do I want to keep those? Sure. Reinforce the fleet. Reinforce it to what? No. Keep it to what it is. Go ahead and tell them to get upgraded. Go ahead and get the patrol fleets upgraded. Research complete. Alright, synchronized computers. Arc emitter. Tachyon lance. Guess we'll go ahead and get the arc emitter. We do have a planet that we are terraforming. It's it's getting close to being done. Yep, those are clones. There's a hologram army. Now the damage numbers that it's oh that it's showing are significantly lower. Well, the morale damage is much much higher. Damage reduced to low morale. Well, looks like that's going to get knocked out. Unless it's able to retreat. I don't know if it managed to retreat or not. Oh, not much we can do about it.
Let's send these armies up here. United Transbeaming Coalition has developed specifications for Colossus type hull configuration. I see everybody's getting Colossus. Mega Shipyard is upgrading. I think we're waiting for the large station to upgrade Ships to a upgrade. citadel. All right, that's patrol fleet Delta. So you go ahead and get yourself back on patrol. Economic stagnation. Then we will go ahead and promote investments. Monthly energy credits minus 25%. That's not going to do great things for us. Ships upgraded. Patrol Fleet Alpha is upgraded. You guys go ahead and patrol. No, actually, Patrol Fleet Alpha. You just patrol here. You stay close to home. I haven't occupied that planet yet. Ships upgraded. But this planet has been occupied. Ships upgraded. Let's see, let's have you go there. You patrol out to there. And actually, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be moving you there.
Hold on. All right, but we're at, I think, the end of this episode, so I think we're going to go ahead and stop here. We did not finish this invasion, but we're pretty close. We are very close. To finishing this invasion. But we are starting to run thin on reinforcements. And, um... Like, can I get them to be friendly enough with us again to, uh... To reopen their borders? We'll see. All right, but we'll go ahead and end this episode here. And uh, we'll see how this goes. See if we have enough firepower to... capture the rest... of these planets. Uh, definitely not going to. Not without being able to bring reinforcements in. And uh, we'll see what we're able to get done. But for now, we'll stop here. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Go ahead, like, subscribe, and comment. And I will see you next time.